Hello all, let's have a discussion related to acidity of substituted benzoic acids. As we know, benzoic acid means benzene with C double bond O OH. If this proton goes, oxygen will be getting negative charge. So, the structure will be C double bond O and O minus. If this is participating in resonance, the resonance structure will be this is O minus, now this is double bond. See, interesting thing is the resonance hybrid point you can write like C O overall negative charge. But this electron pair or this electron pair participation is not possible. That means from benzene side, you don't expect any electrons from this side to this side or between ring, benzene ring and carboxyl and there is no resonance, no resonance, no resonance. Because they are not in same plane. They are not coplanar. Not coplanar, so don't expect any resonance between the benzene ring and carboxylate ion. But, for example, if we are having an electron withdrawing group here, for example, let's say NO2 group, if NO2 group is present here, for example, this is going like this, this is going like this, because of this, there will be some plus charge and carboxylate ion will be like this, so this electron density may come like this. I am not showing any resonance, I am just showing the flow of electrons, flow of electrons may be towards this side and this negative charge, this is the positive charge. So, electron withdrawing groups increases the stability of this carboxylate ion, that is benzoate ion. So, electron withdrawing groups increases the stability, means electron withdrawing groups increases the acidic nature of benzoic acids. At which position they are good, all these points we will discuss. So, just to see that if we have any one place like this for example this electron pair is there if this is coming like this so this part will be having negative charge and as you are discussing this is O minus group so between this negative charge and again electron density is coming like this so this is all overall like full negative charge so whenever electron releasing groups are there that is not good so electron releasing groups are used electron donating groups decreases the acidic nature decreases the stability of the benzoate ion but this is exceptions the exception is if something is at ortho position okay, what happens here for example let's say this is COO minus group and here some methyl group is present this methyl is at ortho position if something is at ortho position, this effect is called ortho effect because of this, this carboxylate ion will be completely out of the plane and when this is completely out of the plane, there is no effect of such group. When there is no effect from this side, the carboxylate ion stability will be more and that benzoic acid is going to be more acidic in nature. So this is ortho effect. Here remember OCH3. OC2H5, OCH2, CH2, CH3, N propyl you say, N propyl or you say N propoxy, ethoxy, methoxy, N propoxy groups. Along with this, we have NH2 group, NH -me methylamine group, NME2 dimethylamine group. These are the exceptions. Except these groups, if any other group is there at ortho position, definitely the acidic nature increases. These are some exceptions based on pK values and all we are saying. So, methoxy, ethoxy, n-propoxy, amine, methylamine, dimethylamine. These don't show the ortho effect. Except these all groups. If anything, blindly you remember, COOH is there, something is here, X, good. This is more acidic because of ortho effect. Simple reason is ortho effect. So, and remember, Ka values if it is more and pKa value is less, the 
that is a strong acid so strength of the acids you can say in terms of ka and pka when ka is more and pka is less the acid is going to be strong acid let's have a discussion related to some groups how these are going to be affecting all the things so first let me take no2 group what is the nature of no2 group minus r and minus i electron withdrawing groups electron withdrawing groups are good so how it is going to work out benzoic acid with no2 with no2 I will look at this when NO2 groups are present which is going to be best we are discussing about electron with the drying group the specialty of this is artha effect artha is always best then NO2 group minus R group this is also good but artha effect is more dominating so this is first place this is second place which is at para then no2 minus i group at meta only minus i is working so this is also fine and the last one is benzoic acid so the final order is when no2 group is present ortho ortho effect more than para then meta then normal benzoic acid here it is working ortho effect here it is working minus R effect, here it is working minus I effect, here no effect. So when NO2 group is there, it will be like this. Now we will take up one other one. That is when methyl group is present. What happens when methyl group is present? What is the nature of methyl group? Methyl group is plus I and hyperconjugation. Hyperconjugation is ortho and para positions. Plus I is distance related as you are moving away. So, look at all this, you can guess here which will be highest, obviously, here methyl group is present this is ch3 this is ch3 when methyl group is present whether methyl is good or not this will have a look at this this is the best one the reason is known to you ortho effect so first place goes to this one is methyl group is good no but this is ortho effect number one group so number second place is this one number third place is this one because in meta position there is only inductive effect but in fourth place there is resonance effect first we don't expect this one because methyl is not a good group but this is at ortho position so this is number one then methyl should not be there that is in pure benzoic acid not no group other no other group is there then meta is better because not a hyperconjugation only inductive effect is there not strong not a stronger effect the para is worst but actually this should go worst least but because of the ortho effect it is first so when methyl is there that is plus i group and hyperconjugation group as well as ortho effect is working the best is ortho then no other group by coh i am writing this you consider as benzoic acid after this meta and last place goes to para this order is to be followed now let's take up och3 group when OCH3 group is there, this is plus R group and minus I group. So let's see what happens in our cases. At R time I'm taking.
so here if you consider this ortho meta and para we'll see about their nature and all here methoxy group is plus r group and minus i group so here only minus i working but here plus r working and here what's are working here ortho effect is working plus r working and minus i working here also minus i working but minus i is weak here also minus i is working but minus i is weak but ortho effect is there as well as what do you say uh, plus resonance effect is there when these are present what are the groups present in this case what happens when these kind of groups are present have a look at this carefully now you guess which is going to be best right methoxy group is yeah plus r group yeah yeah methoxy group is correct minus i group and methoxy group r effect is there so the final order is as we were expecting this is going to be the best one ortho effect is there after ortho effect this is meta and this is para so overall if you see methoxy group and in the remaining cases you can consider like this so ortho is better than meta than para this is when you are taking methoxy group whereas methoxy group is going to be the plus r group and minus i group this is for methoxy group when halogens are present let's consider um, halogens x group if it is present these are purely minus a effect causing plus r is there but minus a effect is very strong effect so let's have a look at this cooh at ortho x i am writing okay here this its role is only minus i minus i is place dependent as we are discussing minus i group is present means that is a very good thing and here ortho effect is there so this is one this is two this is three and this is four okay so when x is present chlorine bromine fluorine fluorine also okay and okay now all these kind of cases the best is ortho then meta then para then benzoic acid the reason is it is position based this is very close next place next place so ortho meta and para will be there the same thing you can expect in case of fluorine also for example if fluorine is there COOH if fluorine is present at ortho if fluorine is there the pKa value is 3.3 at ortho position at meta position its value is 3.9 at spara position its value is 4.1 and normal benzoic acid is without any other group the benzoic only benzoic acid if you take that is 4.2 lower the pk stronger is the acid so ortho is stronger then meta then para then finally this there is no need to remember the pk values as we have an idea we are just giving so if fluorine is present ortho meta para then normal benzoic acid on the basis of what we are saying minus a effect this is distance based only based on the distance we are going to explain this one. a simple question have a look at this COOH I am taking NO2 COOH methyl group I am taking COOH bromine I am taking which you feel the strongest acid yes no2 group because stronger minus i stronger minus r second bromine good third one is benzoic acid because methyl is not good it is hyper conjugation so this will be last so first second when bromine is present third one and this is the fourth 
just concentrate in the same way you can answer any question related to this but here in this case the specialty is ortho effect just to have a look at ortho effect and remember one other thing there is no resonance between c double bond o group and benzene there is no resonance between them they are just attached but they are in different planes there is no resonance but uh, few important lines may be there see this one c double bond o if oh is there this is going to be very good strength very good acid ortho effect will be there that ortho effect why it is there means this is stabilized by hydrogen bonding this kind of hydrogen bondings may stabilize the ortho group when it is present that's why these will become more acidic otherwise you can have a look at this compound c double bond o minus after losing proton if it is a nitro group between them again you can expect some electrostatic attractions which will give you extra stability so such kind of stabilities will be cause for the ortho effect so whenever ortho effect is there whenever ortho group is there except some alkoxy groups and except some amine groups remaining all cases you can consider they are going to be stronger acids right have a wonderful time meet you